Okay, welcome, Parump. Um, I'm Dr. Michael Reiner, uh, your host on the uh, Independent uh, Doctors of Parump. Um, today, we're live, um, and I should be putting the uh, phone number down for a uh, live call-in if you have any questions. Um, I did not really protect a, uh, have a, a topic uh, tonight to really discuss. I wanted to talk about uh, leading into all the nutrition stuff that I've been talking about. I wanted to go into cholesterol and some of the uh, hidden facts about cholesterol. Um, but we have a, I've been working with Vern, the uh, owner of the station, um, about a new product that he's excited about, and this is Dr. TV. Uh, so we decided that we would have a show tonight to talk about that and let the viewers um, in on what's coming their way with regards to Dr. TV, which is, I believe, in my interpretation, it's a 24-7 um, a, uh, uh, type of show about um, all types of medical um, uh, information. It'll be seminars. It will be um, reruns of some of the uh, topics and shows that we've had and some of the new stuff that comes to town, um, stuff about uh, the health care uh, problem that we face and just the latest and greatest stuff. Um, so I was hoping that Vern would, uh, you know, he'll be on the show and we'll be talking about, um, he's excited about it, talk about what's going to be on that show, um, kind of like a 24 seven um, doctor show. Uh, what a great thing. I mean, we all are want to, well, most of us want to get healthy um, and most of us want to tune into something other than. Uh, and uh, uh, I forget the name of the movie at this time. It had come to me before the show's over, but it was actually about a virus that was spread uh, just like this. And uh, so well, it's, it's kind of Matt, scary. Wasn't there Matt Damon with Contagion? Yeah, Contagion was another one. That's another one. Okay. Yep. Well, if you read about Ebola virus, um, it, it actually, uh, there's a lot of similarities between that movie with Matt Damon, Contagion, and the Ebola virus because it is a combination of bat, um, some saliva and a bat, and it actually at the end of Contagion, they show how this virus gets spread, meaning that the, a bulldozer hits a tree, um, the fruit bat uh, drops a piece of fruit, the pig eats the fruit, and the pig becomes infected with the virus, and the restaurant worker has it on his hands, shakes the hands of the actress, and then the virus starts to spread. Um, Ebola has a lot of those, con those factors. If you read about it, it has bat, it has some pig, it has some interesting things. So I don't want to say it was a, you know, one of those you know, foreshadowing events, but um, this is, I mean, normally it's not spread like that. Normally that's why only a few people get it. Uh, they get sick, they, they, they die in a small village, and I understand it's the way they, they, you know, they don't have hygiene over there like here, here that we do. They don't have the food preparatory uh, like we do. Um, but you've isolated, and they've been working desperately to try and control it, and they can't. Um, that's alarming. That's alarming that to alarming. me. That's alarming to me. Yep. Um, and I've even thought even deeper on the subject that uh, they want to know what this virus is, and there's some people that want to capture this virus for other purposes. Yeah. Um, and that that bothers me too. Yeah, from exactly. But I, you know, it's really hard to to think that you know that we're up to something so devious. But stranger things have been known to happen. Yeah. Exactly. What so, a way to take over. Yeah, you know. Yeah, so, I said it, not you. Yeah, I, yeah. <laughs> I don't want to expose uh, too much, but that is a, a very uh, that's an alarming um, alarming uh, thing with this Ebola virus. Um, but anyway, Dr. Doctor TV, right? Yep, Dr. TV. And, and uh, um, this is uh, a twenty four seven doctor show. Um, and are you going to be running um, uh, different? like syndicated shows or is it going to be non-syndicated, meaning you have to buy the rights to get certain reruns of certain shows or are you going to be doing just new information or old information? The, the, actual, the, the network is called DRTV and the network itself gives us the ability to bring in programming from a nationwide syndicator. They have created the network and they're going out and acquiring as much programming as they can for the Doctors TV network. What we're doing here locally is localizing it. So we're going to take uh, and create a branch of it called House of Health. Oh. And House of Health is the actual show that Dr. Reiner is referring to that we're going to spend. It's a two-hour block of five-minute vignettes 
explaining uh, and meeting uh, different doctors, different uh, types of, of medicine, uh, getting into even uh, our animals. Uh, but the opportunity is, is that we're going to take this two-hour block and create these five-minute segments. And at the end of the day, you would have 12 segments for each hour and 24 segments for a two-hour block. And once the two-hour block is made, for the first 90 days, we're going to run that two-hour block uh, three times a day. <clears throat> when that three-hour block is uh, ran, you'll be able to... We all come up sick. We all come up with uh, needs for medicine or uh, the desire to get knowledge at a different time. So it will be somewhat repetitive, but the uniqueness of the program is, is we're going to insert a lot of current information weaved into the actual programming. And that's where Dr. Reiner's gonna come in and help me out and allow for his expertise to talk about different aspects of medicine in Pahrump. And there's, there's so many different levels because there's so many different practices out there, mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. you know, from, I mean, it's just, it's, it's, it's endless. So uh, once the first two hour block is filled, and you know we rotate that through two more times, so it's now a, a six-hour block during the day. I think the blocks start at uh, 6 a.m. and goes to 8 a.m., and then it starts at noon and goes to 2, and then goes from 8 to 10 p.m. Is uh, this something they can get on their TV, or is it something on the computer? Both. It's, okay. it's going to be both. And uh, let me tell you how we're going to do that. The, the uniqueness behind the show really... Oh, let me interrupt you. Yeah. We have to go to break. Okay. So hang on, Prompt. We'll be right back. Interesting discussion. Um, we'll be right back. Thank you for tuning in tonight.